Monkey Nods. It's me, Jack, live at the Monkey House, where right now I'm standing in front of a giant brick wall. Science has proven that jokes are funnier in front of brick. I don't know why that is, but I am not here to question that theory. Coming up next, we've got another pint-sized comedian joining us for a little stand-up comedy. Or is it sit-down comedy? Joining us all the way from Canada, say hello, we monkey dots, to Isla! Oh, good, they're still warm. Hey, Isla! <laughs> Sorry that I cooled down the audience for you, Isla. That was not my intention. Welcome to the Joke Show. Are you excited for this? Yes. Oh, great. Uh, okay, so go ahead and stand up there on the stage. Yep, that's perfect. Right in front of that brick wall there. And I see that you've pushed the sleeves of your sport coat up to your elbows. That's great. Grab the microphone. Okay, good, Isla. It's time to tell us a joke. Are you ready? Yes. All right, lay it on it, Isla. What is your joke? Why did the cookie, why did the cookie go to the doctor? Why did the cookie go to the doctor? Um, I don't know, Isla. Why did the cookie go to the doctor? Because he was feeling crummy. Aww, he was feeling crummy, audience. That's a great joke, Isla. <laughs> oh, boy. I hope that cookie's feeling less crummy now. Uh, did the doctor eat the cookie by any chance, Isla? Um, I don't know. Hopefully not. Yeah, hopefully not. Boy, yeah, I think that would violate the Hippocratic Oath. Although that would probably fulfill the Cookie Monster Oath. Well, Isla, thank you for calling. That's a great joke. Where did you get that? I don't know. Okay, it just it came out of the ether. Well, who knows? Maybe one day you'll be a doctor and you'll uh, meet a cookie right there in your office. Audience, give it up for Isla in Canada. The answer was the cookie was feeling crummy. <laughs>